Hey guys, uh, just uh, going back home to my house. Uh, went to see a friend. He's totally zoning me out, whatever. Keep calling him to see if he wants to hang out, whatever. I'm just not answering his phone, which is kind of making me a little upset, which I'm not going to do anything about. It. I'm just going to leave. I resolve the situation by leaving so there's no, uh, no nothing going on. I don't want to start nothing with him. So I'm just going to go home, forget about me, play a little Xbox, whatever, with some, some other friend online, whatever. And uh, just probably relax the rest of the day. I'm just been, I've been out since 5 this morning or 5 this afternoon, whatever. And it's going to have a beautiful day. It's not too hot out today. It's just kind of cool, chill today. Not, not too warm, not too hot. Just pretty much just right. So, and yeah, so I'm just pretty much videotaping for my safety. So if I get hit by a car or whatever, or somebody yells at me, I have, I have proof that this car hit me, this person yelled at me, and if I have to uh, show it to the, the police for any any reason, I have proof on my, my phone, my camera, whatever. So I have proof that they can't lie about it now because I got proof. And I start doing this more often because I, I just don't want to get hit by anybody. Like, I can still get hit now with with me doing this, but if I do, I have proof. And if the car drives off, I can't, I can't say I fell or I crashed myself. I got hit by a car. I can try to, to show this to the cops if, they, if I do get hit and the driver drives off. But I can't just be like, yeah, I got hit by a car. And like, where's the car at? I'm like, well, he drove off. So, I will have everything on camera because I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna get hit and then not have it on tape. So, I wanna make sure everything is on tape from now on because I don't wanna have any incidents of me getting hit and then not having it on film. I need I need to make sure everything is filmed now from now on because I just don't want to be like I'm lying to the police because I got hit by a car and they don't, they don't think I got hit because they don't see a vehicle all around. Normally they would stay unless they get scared and they might drive off. If they're hiding something they don't want the cops to know about they might drive off and we don't want that that's like the thing we don't want is them, them to drive off and then I have no proof that they did drive off or they hit me so I'm gonna try to make it so everything is on camera now because I I don't want to you know, get hit and then not have this on film. Cause the cops say I should be doing this more often because of accidents that happened in the past. Some nice Mustangs over there. So I just wanna make sure I'm safe. I have this with me all the time. I, I always have my phone on me all the time if I have to call somebody or whatever. I have my phone in, but usually I don't have it with me. I like don't use it unless I'm calling somebody. Yeah, that's where I got pulled over the other night. I don't know if you guys saw that video. But that's where I got that's where I got stopped at right there in that come and go driveway. So it's kind of ow. It's kind of bad that I got stopped is because I didn't have a front light on my, my my bike and so on and so forth. And I guess the cop said he couldn't see me because I didn't have a light on the front and he just went, he went hitting me. 
so it was it wasn't him that told me I should start uh, doing this. It was his other cops and where I used to live. There's the PD right there. A couple couple vehicles up in there. So yeah, that's the PD. Um, so like I said, I'm just going home. I don't. My friend's not talking to me. Whatever. So I'm just screw. I'm going home. Uh, so it's been a really long day already. I've been on my bike for about three hours already today, which is good for me because I need to exercise. Uh, really, biking is not really that much exercise. I don't think. I think working out is more exercise than biking. But I guess biking works with your legs and stuff which I guess is a good workout for your legs I guess not much for your arms though your arms are mostly just on your handlebars not doing not doing anything but uh, so I got a car show on Friday July 1st which is in today's Wednesday so probably going to be Thursdays tomorrow so it's going to be on Friday so in like two days from today it's going to be nice I'm going to try to get up there and uh, do a little blogging about um, of that the car show so it's going to be here in Des Moines, Iowa and I'm from Altoona, Iowa, which you probably probably know where Altoona is. But uh, Des Moines is a big city, downtown Des Moines. So you probably all heard of Des Moines, Iowa. Uh, that's where we're going to the car show at. I mean, it's gonna be cool. I know it's, I don't know where it's gonna be at, but it's gonna be big. Hopefully again this year. Hopefully bigger. Because last year wasn't too, wasn't too big. Like there were a lot of cars and stuff there, but I can't say it was very big. What in the hell is this guy doing back here? This is what I'm talking about, guys. This lady doesn't know how to drive, apparently. I was taking my turn, stop sign back there, and then I go to take my turn, and she starts going, and I have to swing, swing over into the middle of the road almost. Hitting it, getting hit by another oncoming car. Because this lady doesn't know how to freaking drive. So we'll see if we can get her still. So, Indian driver, I guess. I got. I guess they repainted the road, like here in the railroad crossing. Looks really nice. It's new. I think they. Well, they did because I was up here when they were painting them. Well, not up here when they were painting them. Was they were after the fact when they had the road blocked off and stuff. They repainted that line too. It looks like. And there's railroad tracks, going both directions there. They repainted that line too, which looks really nice. They repaint this one up here. They really needed to do it for a long time. And they repaint all of these lines over here too. That one's redone. Uh, so is that one. Like they redid the, all these white lines in which they really needed to do it for a long time. So I'm glad, I'm glad they I'm glad they did now because they were starting to wear off and stuff. So I'm probably in the probably in the vlog here. Um, thanks for thanks for watching, and please rant on comments or rant subscribe, whatever. Um, and what? Subscribe for more videos. Thanks for watching.